Okay. So as is by number five, is number one skyk na identiteit. Now you still use your double angle. So they say use compound and double um, angle identities to prove that. And the first one is no, nothing works. Five point one says sine of three x is equal to three sine x minus four sine to the power of three x. Okay, good. So, as an eerst net kijk naar die linkerkant, en hoe kan ek sin van drie x gaan skryf? Good. So, stem jylle saam, ek kan hom dan gaan uitbrei as sin 2x cos x plus cos 2x sin x. Good. I'm all by. How can I write sine of 2x? 2 sine x cos x. En dan het jy, jy moet sien, die, die, brei uit na die gedeelte toe. The cos x we carry from the previous term. Okay, plus, en dan sê hulle vir jou cos 2x. Now remember, we have three different ones that we can use for cos 2x. Okay, so I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. Do you agree I get that? Okay, good. So, we're going to go to the next one by sin to the max 3x. Do you guys see that? Okay, so I'm going to use my sine double angle conversion. I think you could have used one of the other ones as well. We're going to play around with it and check. But yeah, we're going to see what you can do. So I'm going to use the one that says 1 minus 2 sine squared x. Sorry, I'm going to do the three ways. Okay, so far so good. But now I have almost everything in terms of sign except for this. Who can I cos quadrat x and scribe in terms of sin x? Yes. Okay, and see as I know my sword like a term by my car can tell, then is it by my antwoord. Because 2 sin x plus sin x is 3 sin x, and then I have negative 2 and negative 2, which gives negative 4 sin to the power of 3x. Okay, I want to go next still stand by here uitbreiding. I don't know if any of you attempted one of the other expansions. Anyone? You could have used the cos squared minus sine squared, and then you took out the common factor of cos squared. And then you expand that to a bracket of 1 minus sine squared. Maar met hieries moet jylle rondspeel en kyk wat is dit wat ek soek. Do you see on the right hand side, we only have sine functions. So that's why it 
seems as if you should be using the one that doesn't have any cause functions in the expansion. Can't I lie now? Okay, but those three for the cause double angle, you guys will see when we get to the um, solving of equations as well. You must let it cope out with one, two, as your part. What will you do? Om further to can work, and I'll find you net with that. Okay. Then 1.5.2 We have to prove that. So we don't need to meet on the end of the script is like on the right side. Okay, so I'm going to start with the left hand side again, and how will we write cos of 3x? Self, then, eh? Let's say for specific, we break double hook and so on, we sell the hook. So we're going to say cos of 2x plus x, which I can expand. that okay he didn't is like a mark like I can't even it's honest to it brainy Do I like to have? Okay, and that sine squared x is in the right direction. We're looking for a sine squared x. Okay, my signal on suk mir sin quadrat x is so I'm going to expand this one once again in terms of sine. I think you would have gotten to the same answer if you used the just cause one. The way in them. Okay, so I get here and I go on and I'm out of breath. Ooh, the battery is by pop. This one I expanded to that, and then I simply multiplied in the cos x. In general, now I get two squared like a term, but I can for the infinitive. And then I simply. Factorize out a cost. 